Hey guys, this is the last time you will ever see this angle in background. We're moving currently, as you can probably tell from my face. My allergies are so bad, I cannot breathe. Can't really breathe, my nose is hurting very bad because I have paper towels to wipe my nose. Ran out of tissues. Just kind of struggling a little bit. I took allergy medicine. It hasn't kicked in yet. Hopefully it will soon because I'm struggling. There's so much left to do. There's not that much left to do, but there's kind of a lot left to do. Today's literally the last day we're gonna be in this apartment. We have to turn in our keys today. We really waited last minute to do everything. It's just a fucking crazy stressful situation. I don't know what the fuck, but the place we're moving to now was so stressful. The whole like application process. I just need, I need some air. I need some fresh air or something. I'm highly allergic to dust. We got most of the big stuff out. All of the cabinets and stuff are empty. There's still like a lot of stuff on the counters that needs to be packed. It's kind of a mess still. Currently packing some of the food. The bedroom is bad. There's just shit everywhere. But I got the keys yesterday for the place that we're moving into. I saw it for the first time because I didn't get to see it before. And it's so nice. It's so nice. There's like windows around both sides like sunlight you don't realize how important sunlight is until you don't have any type of direct sunlight coming into your house ever the place that we're going to now is west facing i think south is like the best because it's like direct sunlight but west you get sunlight when the sun's like setting like towards the end of the day I'm in the new apartment right now and I'm gonna show you guys. We got here really late last night and we had to bring everything up, multiple flights of steps, and um, it was a lot. And I was very tired and I was. I just couldn't do it anymore. Couldn't do it anymore. So I'm gonna show you it with everything in it. There's like boxes everywhere. The lighting is kind of good. This is the front door and then you walk in. This is the bathroom. This is the laundry. This is a closet. And then you have the kitchen that has a bunch of boxes and stuff everywhere. There's an extra pantry right here. One thing I'm so freaking excited about is this fridge because I've never had a fridge that has water come out of here and ice. Amazing. And it's a two door, I love that. We've always had like either the freezer on top or on the bottom. There's a lot of space, There's another pantry, this little area over here where the dog's beds are gonna go kind of, living room. The couch is not staying, it's horrible. TV stand and the TV. We actually have sunlight. I can be in the sunlight in my ho own house. That's crazy. We also just got a trash can finally. This is the bedroom. Literally so messy right now. Overview, bedroom. Uh, closet, just like a nice, a nice little walk-in closet. And the bathroom. This is the only thing, this is the only thing that's like unpacked. It's got two sinks, drawers, two cabinets. Nice. Also got this painting from Goodwill, and I really like it. And I need to figure out where to put it. Toilet. We have this shower, which is a walk, like what is it called? Stand, walk-in shower. We never had one of those before either. It's pretty nice. Towel rack. The shower head's like really high up there. And then there's a closet right here. It's kind of unpacked. And that's the bathroom. And then you walk back out, and there's the front door. That's the apartment. I love the island. I love, I love it all, it's great. I could turn the lights on, I guess. I didn't even think about that. Also, one thing I really love is this little, like the sink is very nice. And then the window, love that. And I put my plants there. Oh, there's also storage down here. I always, I keep forgetting about that. I'm gonna do a haul really quick though. We just went to Target and we got a few things. First thing we got is this trash can. It was the cheapest one. I'm gonna take the sticker off. It's nice stainless steel, got a little, pop-up thing. I might put it like right here instead. This is weird. It doesn't really look bad. That's what we don't want. On the other side though, it like hits the top because the top is like bar stool vibes, you know. I also, when we went to Target, I was in the dollar section and I dropped a plant, a really tiny one. It was a fake one, but I dropped it and it broke and I was so uncomfortable. Paper towels. We also got toilet paper that's already in the bathroom. 
got these hand towels. These are like my favorite towels. I love this color so much. And we have two, we have like four of them. So I figured you could take two of them and these and like hang them on the towel rack. It's cute. I got candle lighters. They don't have any. I got this cute ass heart candle. It was only $3. And then I figured I could use the container after it's done. I got tissues because I learned the hard way when you have allergies and you only have like paper towels to use. It hurts. I got this LED color changing light bulb. We want to get a lamp for the living room because there's no light out there. So there's windows, so it's like light. But at night, I feel like it'd be cool to have like a lamp with like color changing light bulb. Shrimp. I only like the mini shrimp. Hand soap. I always get method, but this is a new scent. That just sprayed in my face. I also got this thingy. I'm not sure yet if I'm gonna return this, but it's like a wall hanging accordion thing. And I figured it'd be good to do this whole wall. We can hang like purses, dog leashes, things like that, eggs, suction hooks. Figured this would be nice to put like on the shower, on the outside of the shower. Hang towels there so you could just reach out and grab it. Trash bags, method spray cleaner. I've never seen this scent before, and this it smells so good. It's honey crisp apple. I got a scrub daddy. I've never had a scrub daddy before but I wanted one. I started watching this lady that like cleans people's houses for free, like really, really messy, crazy houses for free. And she uses a scrub daddy. I don't know, I just made one one. Also got this from the dollar section, it's $5. I thought it'd be good to put in the cabinet. Oh, I hope it fits. But for like spices, so you can like just grab it, you know? And is that it? Also got this matcha flavor. So I think that might be it. This was this was expensive. We're ordering pizza. I'm so excited. I'm so hungry. It looks so nice. I love the light. I love the floor plan of this apartment so much. Oh, we also have a balcony. I didn't show you that, but there's a balcony. We've always been on the first floor, and it's definitely um, a hike with the dogs. But I like that like we have all the windows open. No one's really gonna like look in here, and then the dogs aren't gonna be like barking every. Three seconds when someone walks by the window. Bro, I literally thought that was a fucking spider. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's cute. I'm gonna do a mini Goodwill haul. I got this like probably like a week or two ago. It's all in the sink because I'm about to wash it. First thing I got is this vase. It's so cute. It's like pink at the top, like kind of ombre ish, but I just think it's so cute. Then I got this little candle holder. It was like $1.98. It's just like a pillar with like the grip. Very cute. This is probably my favorite thing. I don't know why. And it's so, this is so unnecessary to have. This lighting is horrible. These corn on the cob holders, they're green. This is like my new favorite color. I don't know what's going on, but I just literally want to paint everything green. And there's eight of them. Like a full like corn on the cob plate. I'm obsessed with them. I also looked them up like online see how much they were. I saw someone was selling a set of six of them for $60. So I was like, I got eight. I'm not gonna sell them probably because I really like them, but that's what I got from Google. fucking sweating profusely. I'm doing my book on my shelf. I think that I need to get another show. I don't know where I would put it, but I'm already almost at that point where like I have too many. But these are my favorite book series. And then I'm just gonna probably add some of my other favorite books here. And then up top, I have my pops and I have the Grishaverse. I'm so tired and it's 12 o'clock. It's midnight and I look like I'm struggling, cause I am. Cause my allergies are wild and I took a nap that made me enter a different universe and come back and that's a lot for me. I'm thinking of doing like a shelf of all paperbacks. These are like my favorite like standalones. Some of my favorite standalones. Oh my God, I almost fell. I do like hardcovers 
and then my favorite paperbacks and then just random books down here. I think that's what we're gonna do. Haven't read this one yet. I heard it was good. Invisible Life of Addie LaRue. So we'll be trying to read that soon. Dude, why am I struggling to like be upright? Me before you, this was a good book, but I read it so long ago. Thrifted this, haven't read it yet. I really, really need friends that read. Box is empty. Making progress. 